Welcome back to another segment of our uh, continuing discussion on Intercept U about using Intercept SIPs in the construction world. We're talking with Chuck Pfeiffer, one of our re regional sales managers. Welcome, Chuck. Thank you. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the. We hear a lot about uh, thermal bridging, and we we talk about that a reduction in thermal bridging. And what is that? What is thermal bridging, continuous uh, uh, insulation, and how does that all work together with intercept SIPs? Yeah, um, I've just recently learned what thermal bridging is since we're working with intercept. So when I was doing my own construction, although I wasn't aware of of that actual term. I was aware of the, the benefit of using SIPs to prevent thermal bridging. So basically, uh, you've got continuous insulation. Um, I think it's about 2 to 3% uh, penetration, otherwise continuous, whereas traditional stick frame is about 25%. So uh, you have a much more uh, efficient uh, structure in terms of its insulative capacity, and uh, you don't have any heat loss or gain through uh, the studs themselves. Does it really make a difference? Oh, absolutely, yeah. Yeah, I mean, you, when you think about it, you, in, in, in uh, addition to the fact that you have uh, no air movement between the inside and outside of the structure, whereas with you know stick framing, it's considerable. Uh, when you put those two together, you've got really a much more efficient, uh, going in, into the future where the government is starting to mandate much more efficient structures, uh, it makes total sense for anybody, from builders to homeowners. It's interesting. I was a drywall contractor for many years, and when I sprayed texture on cold days, you could see every stud because that much cold traveled through the studs, and it dried much, much slower. So it really does make a difference. We have this behind me. Uh, you can see the, the solid foam. Now there's a top, a top plate and a cap plate. There is that you mentioned that 3% uh, thermal bridging. There is some on a, on a SIP structure, but what a dramatic reduction, and it really does it really does on paper, it, it proves over and over again that it makes a remarkable difference. We really appreciate your insight on, on this yeah, on one, subject. One final thought. Uh, yeah. So I was watching a little uh, a video on thermal bridging and they did a, a heat signature mapping thing where you see where the, the, the uh, heat is coming through and you see all the studs just boom, boom, boom right there. And it's pretty cool to see that. Really, really drives the point home. Yeah, yeah, and really a significant difference in our value of the whole wall, our value, and it's all said and done. All right, thanks again. Appreciate it. You got it.